Expose the entire library of training and help items you have directly to your employees within Teams. As you can see that in this particular case, I have the entire library of content, 1442 items exposed directly within Microsoft Teams as a tab. Now this name could be renamed to whatever your company name is. So it's easy distinction by your users of where to go to get help. When they click on any of these items, they'll get the video and other content that's available right there. A lot of this content is coming free for Microsoft that is available with the free product of Visual SP. However, if you wanted to go for the premium product, you can add your own training content as well. With your library, you can go ahead and configure it. I can move things around to group. I can change the application to show, for example, let's say only Excel. And once I'm satisfied with the view that I have, I can take that view, copy it as a link, and then make a new tab as I've done over here. So in this case, it's only showing Excel content that people can view. Once again, they can click on it and the help is gonna be available right there at the moment of need. You can also have training or help available for specific business functions like HR or marketing or whatever else you want to serve content for. In addition, while in the post area over here or in the chat, people can go ahead and click on this icon for Visual SP. Do a search for the content that they're looking for. In my case, I'll search Planner. Once it shows me content for Planner, I can go ahead and view it if I would like. Or I can go ahead and click on this link over here. The link for that particular item is going to be right here in my messaging box. Now I can say to my colleague, check this out, for example. Click on send and they'll get a link directly to that item. Using Visual SP, expose the entire library of training and help items that you have within your organization, starting with the free content from Microsoft and building from there.